What we do here is we bring together all of the earth sciences and planetary sciences. What I then do is of course present the latest research. What this meeting also provides is a great place to, to interact with each other, uh, to build new coalitions, new consortia for, for new science ideas and new projects. And for those who wish, because we have so many disciplines here together, to cross borders, look at other, other disciplines, uh, get inspired by them, learn from them or just satisfy your curiosity. So this year's General Assembly was again a great success. Um, this year we had 14,231 presentations, um, actually 40% orals um, and the rest posters and PICO. PICO was 5% this year, so it was an increase compared to last year. And we had um, side events like Ray Debates, Union Symposia, Town Hall Meetings, Splinter Meetings and so on. This year we have again a theme uh, and it is uh, a voyage to scales. Um, the idea was that um, we all know that all the processes uh, going on on planet Earth and the different spheres are happening on different scales. And we had here uh, some um, exhibition spots, for example we had a spot, the scales of the General Assembly, where, where we had live numbers of people being at the conference. We also had uh, the scales of peer review, where we wanted to show the people the dimensions of EGU Journal. We also had an exhibition spot where we, have, where we have shown photos from the photo book. The first spot was um, the scales in art. Most of the scientists know how to interpret scales in their discipline. But what uh, is the artistic interpretation of this theme? This year we've really uh, upped the amount of activities available to young scientists. Um, that's including short courses but also sessions convened by young scientists and PICO sessions in particular. In addition to that, um, we've divulged a lot of the things that are going on at the General Assembly through all our social media channels. This year has seen more short courses than ever before in the region of almost 50 and I'd say highlights for me have been the finding funding short courses, both the ERC starting grant one and then the more generic one that we have later on in the afternoon. When it all gets too much at the General Assembly and you want a little break, the place to go is the Geo Cinema where we show science films and documentaries. We've got the photo competition where we showcase uh, 10 of the best photos submitted to the Imago Image Repository. Finally, we also have the video competition where young scientists are encouraged to submit a short three-minute video communicating their science.